Hello and welcome to Excel-BoardTemplates.com. My name is Steve True. Please visit our website, Excel-BoardTemplates.com, so you're sure to get the latest charting techniques to help your dashboard shine. All right, uh, today I'm going to show you how to quickly create a chart from your data set, uh, and that's going to be using some keyboard shortcuts that you may or may not be aware of. Um, first off, uh, if you're going to create a chart from this data, what you'd most likely do is highlight the data in Excel 2007, then you'd go up to your insert ribbon, then you'd go find the chart type that you'd like. Let's go ahead and pick a column chart, and then we pick 2D clustered column. Uh, and as you can see, there is our chart, uh, kind of a, a few steps, but there's a keyboard shortcut to take care of that in one fell swoop. So let me highlight the data, uh, and if you hit your F11 key, uh, you will notice that it creates a worksheet or a chart sheet of just your chart. So you can see what it would look like in a 2D column chart. It's the exact same thing you see before. Um, but I don't usually like doing chart sheets. So I didn't really like the F11 trick um, when I first knew about it because I, I like seeing the charts, especially in a dashboard template. Real estate is king, and if you are using an entire page for your chart, it's just too much wasted space and wasted ink. Think of all the other uh, pieces of information you can put on this worksheet. Um, so I like embedding charts and create a dashboard within a worksheet that will print on one page or be visible on one page within a spreadsheet. So uh, another quick and easy way to do it and to embed the chart instead of creating a chart sheet is to highlight your data and instead of hitting the F11 key, hit hold your Alt key down and then F1. Alt and F1, and look at that, it creates your, your uh, chart embedded in the worksheet, so pretty quick and easy. From here, you can go ahead and change your chart type up on the design ribbon if you desired a different type of chart, like a line chart or something else, but uh, it's a way to quickly create a chart, especially if you just want to see how the data will look when you chart it. So. Uh, that's your quick tip for the day. My name is Steve True. Please visit our blog, excel-boardtemplates.com, so you'll learn these and other great charting techniques for Excel.